Me and my wife had been together for 12 years. Eight of them married and have a six-year-old daughter. Here is how I found out about the affair. Honestly, I'm glad I came to know about the affair. I now feel numb and don't feel anything for my wife anymore, who was just using me for money, I guess. I make thrice as much as she does. My only concern is my daughter. Here is how I came to know about it. For the last five months, I've been working like hell, lots of overtime and weekend work, to save money for her father who is supposed to undergo an operation later next month. The stress from work and all made me irritated at that day, seeing my wife and giggling while texting on the bed rather than chatting or asking me about how I was doing made me snap, and I grabbed her phone. Sadly, it was locked in the process, so I asked her for the password, to which she vehemently refused and told me I was going insane. I then asked again and told her I would take the phone to her parents' home and get it unlocked somehow and read the contents in front of them. Her parents are very religious. If they knew she had an affair, they wouldn't even waste a breath in thinking about abandoning her. To which she stood silent and told me that she wants out of the marriage. I still held onto the phone and told her if she told me the truth, I would not tell her parents at which point she admitted that she was having an affair for the past two months with a co-worker. I still asked her for the password and finally got it out of her and told her to go out of the room. I immediately locked the room and read the messages and found that it has been going on for about four months. Twice of what she told me, she couldn't tell the truth even after getting caught. Connected a phone to my laptop and downloaded an entire chat history. I still don't know what made me do this, but I'm glad I did this. I then invited her in and asked what she wants to do now. And she told me she wants divorce. And so I told her to wait for a week and then decide again. Think about the daughter. And if you still want divorce, I will give you one, but I will take my daughter's custody with me. When I asked her the reason for affair, she told me that I was not spending enough time with her and was more focused on work. To hell with that. The reason I am working like a donkey and not having enough time even for myself is for her father's surgery. When I told her why she didn't tell me about this earlier, that she wanted more time, she told me she didn't get the chance. I wonder how she couldn't win when we were still eating breakfast, no dinners for me over time and staying in the same house. When I asked her, did she not know the reason for whom I was working all this time? She just stood silent as if it doesn't even concern her. She had a so what kind of face. Yesterday, she told me she still wanted a divorce and wants the daughter with her. I told her that's not gonna happen as I already saved all her chat history and will use it in court to gain custody. I made it certain to her that I will never leave my daughter. She was crying. I just left the room to go to my daughter's room. After that, I also told her to make her boyfriend fund her father's surgery as I was not going to pay any. Stopped over time since last week and started spending more time with daughter and honestly, I will still pay for the surgery whatever I have saved up until now. I am an orphan and I love them like my own parents but just told that to make her suffer was angry, justified I guess. At this point, she started saying sorry and begged me to pay for surgery and will stop her affair and will work on marriage. Honestly, I don't believe her anymore. This marriage will fall apart as soon as the surgery is done. I am thinking of going ahead with a divorce but will take custody of the child. No need to pay a limited state loss in case of an affair. Child custody I think I can gain from the affair proof and also in exchange for the money of her father's surgery. My friends also believe I should go ahead with the divorce. Lawyer friend did too and assured me of the custody. I want to know am I doing the right thing by going ahead with a divorce. Mostly worried how it would impact the daughter and also how I should break it to her family. Don't want to lie to them. They are like parents to me. Edit. As most people got theirs wrong, let me correct. I am not going to completely cut the mother from my daughter's life. However, I want my daughter to live with me. Update. Met wife's parents today and told them about my decision to divorce and the situations that led to it. Glad I met them today since at first they even refused to let me inside the house since my wife told them that I was a philanderer and I was harassing her and my daughter. Thanks to her brother who also lives with them allowed me a chance to know my side of the story. 
gave them time to process this, and I'm waiting inside a guest room with my daughter and niece who are taking a nap. Update 2. Consult a lawyer. He assured me with proof of adultery and all I can get custody of my child and also no alimony, and I get to keep everything I own. He also insisted on finding more details about the affair partner and hire a PI for that saying it might be of some help in the case, that it's better to be prepared. I agreed to it, since he knows his work and he would be handling PI too. He told me if they start by early next week, we could get a court hearing within two to three weeks time. I am from India. In here, I can get complete custody of the child due to adultery.